concept of psychic functioning or predictions. If you know, again, that everything exists now, then it is not a surprise that someone who is tuned to a parallel probability reality could pick up on the idea that that reality that you could shift to may have a high degree of energy behind it, a high degree of momentum behind it, may be the most likely manifestational reality to occur if things do not change. But understanding the fifth law that everything changes gives you the opportunity to say, well, if I understand that that prediction is not necessarily a prediction of the future, but a prediction, a sensing of the energy that exists in the present, because everything is here and now, then I understand that it's simply an opportunity to know where the energy lies now, and to know that in the fifth law everything changes, that if it doesn't necessarily have a lot of energy behind it, or the energy behind it can be changed, then the prediction doesn't necessarily have to manifest if it's not something that you prefer. And by adding energy to it, in a different direction, by defining it in a different way, by using it as simply a present-day sensing of where the energy is, instead of an absolute prediction of something that's inevitable or unavoidable, then you can use the law of change to add energy to it in a particular way that can allow the prediction to render itself obsolete by having known what it is telling you about the present energy. So again, using the five laws, and comparing metaphysical concepts that you have lived with for thousands of years against that framework can give you far more clarity about what the mechanical truth is behind many of the metaphysical or spiritual experiences you may have 